60 acres in Etowah County, Alabama. It's very private and secluded, does have power. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, it's Chad Kemp, your Alabama land agent, and we have 60 acres for sale in Etowah County, Alabama. And this property is located down an easement, dirt road, will require a well, does have power at the gate there, does have some trails through the property that you can access for trail riding as well as hunting as well. Be a great place for somebody looking for seclusion, be great for somebody looking to hunt or possibly build a cabin just to get away from the day-to-day -day workload. So stay tuned and enjoy the video. But before you go, we do have links down below that you can actually click that will take you directly to this property where you can see the pricing maps and other details as well. But also the price is going to be in the comments. So if you have any questions or comments you'd like to make, be sure to uh, fill that in down below and look for the pricing there because the pricing does change sometimes as well. But also be sure to call me if you want to give me a call. The number is going to be posted in the video as well. And again, as always, thanks for watching. This property is located northeast of Birmingham, Lakey going towards Chattanooga. It's kind of in between there at the, the Atala exit. So you're only an hour from Birmingham, 29 minutes from Gadsden downtown hour from Huntsville, you're going to be two hours to almost an hour and a half to Chattanooga, two hours from Atlanta, Georgia. You would take the Atala exit, and that's the direction that we're headed now. It's kind of towards Chattanooga, and you take exit 181, and then you hang a left and go on 77, cross over some railroad tracks, continue to 278, take a left, and then you'll come to Carnes Chapel Road there where the Tyson feed mill is. You'll cross over these railroad tracks and you'll go down Carnes Chapel to a stop sign and, and hang a right. And then you'll see a road to your right called Bull Hollow Road. And you'll follow Bull Hollow Road all the way to 935. And there'll be a mailbox here on your right. And you're going to take a right on this dirt, bumpy road. Now, it's very convenient to a lot of places there in Atala. As you're seeing, there's a Walmart, O'Reilly's. There's also a Starbucks there if, that, if you're into coffee. But over in Gaston, you have your Lowe's, you have your Academy Sports, you do have a hospital, two hospitals. Then you also have a Publix there in Rainbow City on 77. But right there where that green dot was, was where you turn in. That's the mailbox there. And you go down this dirt road. And as, you can, as you can see, there's power on this road, not public water. You'd have to drill a well. Yeah, but that's part of being out in the country. If you're looking for something that's off-grid, but you still wanted to have power, well, this would be for you. Be a lot of opportunity to build that private cabin. And as you follow this road, you're going to come to this gate. Do not continue to left because that's private. But t right there at the gate, you're fine to park there. And then we can meet you and show you the property and take you along these trails. Lots of trails on the property. Good four-wheeler trails that could be opened up. And uh, if you have a question, you can call me there at this number there that's being posted. Also, be sure to click the link down below in the description. Also, it will be in the comments. It will take you directly to this property, and you can play with a Google map. And uh, if you have any questions, you, you can be glad to put it there, and we'll be happy to answer it best we can. But lots of deer in the area. I did have some property above this um, particular property up on the mountain. So the deer do go back and forth up and down the mountain. And we have some old pictures of some deer. But that's this. these deer pictures you're going to see is from an old listing up above this property. So, But lots of good mixtures of the property and the timber here. You do have some young timber. You have some older mature timber. You have some of this part of the, part of the property that it does go up the mountain. Be great to shoot guns because you have a backstop to be able to do that if you wanted to. Um, you do have some natural little water that kind of comes through from the mountain itself. Now, I don't know if that's year-round or not, but that's something that I found on site. You do have an area that has a green field. They do have a shooting house that you can improve there. Um, just a lot of great little recreational place to get away if you want to be off-grid. Maybe this is something just to get away during the weekends, or maybe you want to live here. There's a neighbor that lives here full-time. 
they have a large track of property that they, they live on. And um, so this could be your spot to live on or to enjoy with your family. So if you have any questions, just be sure to reach out to me. We'll be happy to answer anything that you've got. But again, you can comment below or you can um, give me a call. But the link will be in the comments. Thanks again.